Look, it's bad. This is a long-standing problem. There's about 300 drugs in shortage right now, active shortages, and so that's a high level. It's the highest it's been since 2014. But this has been a long-standing challenge. I dealt with it when I was at FDA going back to around 2003. That's how old this problem is. And this, the issue is that this mostly affects sterile injectable drugs. That doesn't mean that small molecule pill form drugs aren't in shortage, but the majority of these shortages are around the sterile injectable drugs.